What's that up there? It's a bird. It's a plane. It's some Superman bullshit. In today's mega physical media topic video, I will be talking about the brandly new announced Superman collection. I'm going to go over all the amazingness that comes with this collection, but I'm also going to talk about what it's missing that is absolutely embarrassing. And then I will talk about my decision on if I'm going to buy this one or not. So let's talk about it. So first to talk about what the Superman collection actually comes with. And this is brought to us by supermansite.com. Zavi have announced the upcoming release of Superman 1 through 4 4K Ultra HD Steelbook Collection from Warner Bros. Home Entertainment, which will be available for pre-order beginning Monday, February 20th. The collection will release on Monday, April 17th and includes Superman the Movie, Superman 2 Theatrical Cut, Superman 2 The Richard Donner Cut, Superman 3, and Superman 4 The Quest for Peace. The collection will also come with premium extras including Superman 78 number 1 collectible comic book, certificate of authenticity, a photo book 3D Phantom Zone lenticular, and hours and hours of special bonus features. This collection looks to offer quite a bit for us, which is excellent. I love all these extras we're going to be getting. I love all the steelbook looks to each of these movies. And you're in a steelbook case as well, which is going to be very displayable on the shelf in a super way. We're also getting both cuts of the Superman 2 movie, which is absolutely necessary because I do really prefer the Richard Donner cut myself. But that is awesome for fans of these Superman movies to have everything together in a nice collection set. Now to get into some major issues with this collection and some super items that it's absolutely lacking on. First of all, it's being advertised as a five film Superman collection. When I hear five film Superman, I'm thinking of my DVD set here that actually has Superman Returns. Well, this does not have Superman Returns. It is saying five films because they're counting both different cuts to Superman 2 as two different films. I've never counted two different cuts of a movie as different movies entirely. That's just two different versions. It's still the movie. So I think that's false advertisement there. And I think that's very misleading uh, for Superman fans out there. I would have loved Superman Returns in this collection box set. Hey, while you're at it, throw in Man of Steel. Why is Henry Cavill always getting kicked out of everything? Why not get all of those Superman movies together in one box set? That would have been absolutely amazing. Get a really nice steel book for Man of Steel. Ooh, that would have been fantastic. I would have loved to seen that. So even though there's a lot of great super items in here, they're definitely missing a couple items and presenting it in a way that I just don't think is the best. Now to talk about my decision on if I'm going to be pre-ordering this Steelbook collection and picking it up, I actually am not going to pre-order this one because I think this price here is way too hefty. It's about $130 off of Amazon right now to pre-order. To me, that's really a large price for just getting four movies. Once again, it's not five films like they're advertising. It's four movies. And that's pretty expensive for each of those films. Over 30 something bucks for each of those still books. I know you're getting it in a nice box set. I know you're getting the other collectibles in there, which is great. But still, I don't love that 130 price range. Now, if they were to say this was an $80 set, I'd be all for it. Maybe even a 90 hundred dollars but if you're gonna be charging a hundred thirty you better be throwing in some superman returns at the very least once again hey you throw in mana still with that one i'm sold on the 130 price point so what i think i'm gonna do is i'm gonna wait to see this one drop because i think it might drop i could see this one maybe getting to a hundred bucks or maybe even less than that usually these collection box sets as long as they don't sell out will drop in price over time so i kind of learned my lesson with these big box sets that hey you know what let's wait a little while see that price cut and then get it when it's on sale so i don't definitely need this right now it's not like i need i mean i got my dvd collection right there yeah the 4ks are going to be a big upgrade but i already have superman the movie in a nice 4k slipcover that already came out so i'm pretty content with that 
Yeah, I would love the Superman 2 movies in 4K. I would absolutely love that. Superman 3 is all right. I probably like that one more than most. But Superman 4 uh, could take that one or leave it. So at that $130 price point, I don't think I can justify a pre-order here. But once again, those are just my own personal thoughts and decision. Let me know in the comments below. Are you going to be picking up the Superman collection? Or are you going to be waiting for a price drop? Skipping it all entirely? And what do you think of it overall? Let's have those super discussions down below. Thank you so much for supporting the channel on that level. If you're interested in Patreon and getting those exclusive content and other perks and all those great shout outs, make sure you check out the link on my channel page for all those wonderful mega memberships. And if you love collecting physical media just like me and being part of this amazing league of mega film fans, make sure you subscribe right now. That way you stay entertained and up to date on all the latest physical media topics. Take my hand. I swear eternal loyalty. And if you enjoyed this super physical media topic, check out my steelbook collection right here. Also like the video. And this is Mega Mike the Movie Man reminding you to make every day a movie day.